Hi, this is Keith Trim from Keith Trim Dragon Art. I'm here with Cheryl, my wife, and we're here to talk about Star Trek and MASH. Uh, in the evenings, we watch that almost every night, and uh, my favorite is Star Trek, and hers is MASH. Why do you like MASH so much? I don't know. I think it's nostalgia. I used to watch it with my dad when I was a little kid. Same way with me, and I used to watch Star Trek when I was a kid. Funny thing is, I only like the original series. Do you like anything else besides that, or what do you like? Well, honestly, I really... I discovered that I only really liked the first three seasons of MASH. Like, after Trapper John goes home and and Colonel Blake dies, it's it just gets weird. It's not funny anymore. It is like the whole sh show changed. Uh, on the video here, I'm doing some watercolor stuff with the elephant. I decided to do something besides the monsters, uh, even though he does do have two big fangs there. So I'm, I'm watering the, the painting down. Which those is, are tusks. Tusks with plain water that I'm putting over uh, like a wash of colors and letting it do its watercolor thing so it has a different kind of look to it. <clears throat> when I first started doing this two years ago, I did a lot of watercolors. And I kind of got away from it. So um, what what's your favorite, uh, not the episode, but who's your favorite character in MASH? Um, I think my favorite one is probably Trapper John. And why is that? Because he's funny. He's probably the funniest. That's probably true. He probably is. Um, so he always he's always like he's kind of in the background, you know, because Hawkeye is like the main dude, but Trapper's funnier. That's kind of funny because that really dates us. Because if, if it does, if you were that young when you watched it, how are we talking originally when it came out or reruns or both? Well, I don't. When did it originally come out? Seventy. Something. 70 through 70, 81 or something like that. Yeah. So, um, when so I, was, I was pretty little when it came out. When I was a little kid, I have memories of me on the couch watching Star Trek with Dad, you know. And um, Captain Kirk is always my captain, uh, Star Trek-wise. Um, I'm not a big fan of the reboots. They're okay. But and I could watch the original series over and over. Jean-Luc Picard isn't bad. Yeah, but those stories, uh, they're just not... The fun kind of stuff. There's a couple fun episodes in there. There are. There really are. Some, there's some good science fiction in there, too. I'm not saying it's terrible. But, you know, I like to see a good Star Trek fight. You know, where, where they don't even try to hide the fact that they're using stunt doubles, you know. It, it, it seems like a high school production. And that's the charm of it for me. Um, what do you think about that? About Star Trek? Yes. Um, I like the original series, yeah. I mean, I think that... Captain Kirk, the way that Shatner plays Captain Kirk is fantastic. And I think that the stories are more are much more simple. You know, is this amoeba is going to attack you or or are this robot is going to come and attack you. It's kind of like it's a throwback to the 50s and 60s sci-fi. Um, but I like the music. I like the old style, the way they shoot it. The, the lighting is incredible. You don't get that kind of stuff nowadays. It'd be really nice if there was a, another TV series out there that was as engaging as we find those two things. Um, but there isn't. No. <laughs> so um, now, you, now you just got me stuck. Now I know what to talk about. You changed the well, subject on me. I mean, okay, so we don't agree on on TV shows at all, hardly. Because I would watch Friends over and over again, and you can't stand that show. That's because it's, it's, it's a horrible show. No, it's not it's, horrible it's, at all. It's, it's not funny. It's written it's hilarious. terrible. It's hilarious. The acting is terrible. The acting is great. Um, it's dated nowadays. Um, it's not any more dated than anything else. I don't know. I just can't. It's just, that show is just ridiculous. You just don't get it. I, I get it. I get it. It's terrible. No, you don't. If you got it, you would think it was funny. It, it would even funny that the first time I saw it in a hee-hee-ha-ha -ha kind of way, but uh, I just don't, I just, I don't know. The problem is you watch it, like, constantly. I don't watch it at all because you complain about it constantly if I do. And there's a, for good reason, because it's a terrible show. So you can't say that I watch it constantly because you won't let me. Look, we're halfway through my video and I haven't talked about it. Now we're adding some color to it. I want some some uh, lighter burnt umber. Um, I was going to I was gonna glaze it, but I thought, no, because elephants are actually gray. I'll just do some highlights on it. Looking back at it, maybe I should have glazed it, but I don't know. So it's kind of a mixture of gray tones, and then I add some color to it. And I'm adding more highlights to it with the uh, umbers. I just add some white to it. So my elephant's an elephant. I like the elephant. 
I, I knew when I got towards the end of it, I was going to do all kinds of crazy stuff with it. Then I thought, you know, maybe I should try some different colors. I've seen some different paintings where they actually do this. And I thought, what the hell? I've done enough paintings now I can experiment. So I started adding some blues in here to, to backfill the shadows. <clears throat> and then, uh, as you'll see later, I added some reds and stuff. So anyway, back to what we're talking about. Oh, how bad Friends is. Yeah, how bad is it? How bad you don't get it? <laughs> And, you know, I could watch, you know, Spock do his live long and prosper a hundred times and it's still fresh and, re and cool to me. Uh, Chandler making a joke? Uh, no. Yeah. Um, so, so. Yeah, we watch Star Trek all the time. I know. Cause and it's, I don't complain. It's all, We only watch certain ones. And there's, there are some Star Trek episodes I think are just, you know, pretty boring and pretty terrible. So I have like a handful of um, maybe 10 episodes I like a lot. Uh, what's that one where that that guy who um, plays the harpsichord? What's that one called? I know the name of it. Of course, I'm on recordings. I can't remember the name of it. Uh, the, the Spire of Gothos. That's his name. That's my favorite episode. Or the one with the Klingon. Uh, the, he's a Western actor, but he's a Klingon. I can't remember the name of that one. Uh, but I have a couple of really good episodes. What's your favorite MASH episode? Um, I'm not sure. Is it the one where uh, 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 Radar saves the day and, and performs a surgery or something? Or um, come on, we got like I know oh. I'm trying to think of what. Oh, like... hold, hold on a second. Right here is my display downtown. I have an art display downtown here. I got like eight paintings, and uh, if you want to come to Fairbury, Nebraska, you can come and look at my. So I actually do something with this artwork besides put it on YouTube. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Um, I don't know. I think, honestly, the pilot is funny. The original pilot is funny. And the one with um, General Steele, where Harry Morgan plays General Steele, and it kind of goes off the deep end. Okay, we've got a few seconds here. Subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe, and follow, and all the other things you got to do. <clears throat> like it, and subscribe it, and follow it. Thank you very much.